how is it going over my champion that I'm here bringing you a special video because not only today I'll be opening a big box. We've got a guest, self-proclaimed Final Fantasy fan. Scott will be the ethereal voice you can hear now. Say hi Scott. Ooh. And I'm not self-proclaimed, I just am a fan. <laughs> I knew you'd uh, push back on that. I was, I was gonna I was gonna be I was gonna be more um more flattering, but I thought self-proclaimed is probably... Uh, yeah, probably I guess everyone's a self-proclaimed if you're just a fan. That is true, that is true. So you're a big fan <laughs> of Final Fantasy, as is me. Oh, 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 oh yes. Everyone. Uh, and you, which is why I brought you on the video mostly. Not mostly, but you know, you used to play Final Fantasy, the trading card game. I did, uh, semi-competitively as well for a year or so before I just really? couldn't find the time to do it and the money to keep doing it. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. Like, I, I bought, like every card and stayed up with releases up until the fourth set and then they increased how many they were releasing or something so it's going to be yeah. three, new, three new sets a year which is just too much for a card game i think it was yeah i went up to opus six and that was obviously at the point when they started releasing free a year and um i got to opus seven and i was like this is gonna get expensive especially yeah. if you're trying to get a play set <laughs> yeah if you want to play set everything it's expensive right but i guess if you're yeah. playing competitively then you just you look at the checklist and just buy what you want anyway, right? So. Yeah, you build a deck and then just buy the cards for that, but I'm a collector at heart, so it yeah, wasn't so. going to happen that way. Please don't stab that box with a knife. <laughs> All right, I'm going to. So what have we got? 36 packs per box. The standard, I guess, for the for a trading card game. Uh, each pack has got 12 cards, randomly taken from a pool of 136, plus 148 premium cards. Um... A pack might contain two identical cards. Thanks for that little bit of a disclaimer. I wonder if someone complained enough that they had to write a pack might contain two identical cards on it. Um, <laughs> but that's generally, like old, um, that's like loot boxes, isn't it? They're just like, oh, we've got to tell you that you're going to get screwed over at some point. Yeah, I mean, this is better than loot boxes, like because this is not old. I think we're up to fourteen now. Is that right? Thirteen's just launched. Opus thirteen. So this one's a, a little yeah. bit old, um, but it tells you like how many commons, how many rares. Uh, all that kind of stuff. We're going to be getting... Is it one foil per pack still these days? It's one foil per pack. Uh, generally a chance at a hero and a legend card of some sort. Plus, obviously, the foil can be a hero or a legend. Cool. And the heroes and legends are... ideally what we're hoping for today. Yes, I was going to say. So Scott has got the, uh, the, the screen up. He's got the chase cards, what we're looking for. The, the, all the good stuff. But we're mostly here to look at the incredible art. Hell and, uh, yeah. Reminiscent of how cool. <coughs> Which, on the note of art before you open that box, that there yes. <coughs> is some special art that was done for. Well, they do a special art for every box. So they always have unique art. Uh, yeah. And you actually find those on the cards. Now, that there is Bahamut for anyone who's a Final Fantasy fan would probably have recognized him. But yes. that art itself was done by uh, Toshi, uh, is it Toshi Taka M uh, Musada. Uh, Musada. And yeah. that was a unique design he'd done for the artwork on this game. Oh, cool. Ooh. Ooh. Hang on a minute. Let me just, I'm going to do it like they're doing the shops. Absolutely mangling this, but you get the little... Display box. Look at that, though. Look at um, that artwork. It came with a... That no. was a promo, if I'm not mistaken. Has that got PR at the start of the number? I can't quite see it. Uh, PR44, also 8-006L, uh, so a legendary from this set. Yes, so, what I'm gonna so do... that was a... Promo is so if I hold the cards roughly this height and then refocus, you should get it a bit clearer. There you go. Yeah, that's done it nicely. Yeah, also, so they... I'm obviously having to hold these sideways and, and <laughs> the camera's a bit weird. So if I like put my arm there, this is the focus point. Cool. Um, yeah, yeah that's cool, man. They do look cool. Stuff. So the idea behind those promos were if you look at them, they don't have the borders around the names and the text. Oh, yeah, that's it's literally full art. Yeah, I love full art cards. So yeah, it doesn't have the borders. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, that's what made that a promo card of what <laughs> I'm going to laugh if you get that exact card but the legendary version <laughs> I mean it says on here yeah promo slash legendary so it's number six is the cloud legendary for that um, mm. I love full art the, the full art magic stuff is the best yeah the full art is like, just... the best cards I ever got in magic like the full art lands are just amazing because nobody needs text for magic lands do they so <laughs> it's a piece of land that's all I care about oh, just look at that artwork though I know, this is really cool. Now, this, this is a problem with uh, Droid Cam. I'm using my phone as the, the, the bit, is that the focus is not automatic, so I have to click the focus button. Mm. So now you can see the cool packs. Um, just, we will... the, oh, just the quality of 
everything they've done for the FFTCG Opus, which, if anybody doesn't know, is actually a re-release of the Crystal series they had originally in Japan only. Yeah. And they've redone sure they've some of the cards. Now, right? they, they've, caught up, they've caught up slash overtaken now, right? They have now, yeah, because Crystal series stopped, but when they decided to bring it worldwide, they obviously redone the Opus. So some cards are identical, but most of them have changed. Oh, yeah, and the rules, I think, got streamlined. Yes, the rules are cool. It's pretty unique as far as um, it's pretty. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Cloud in the background there. It's like don't uh, get also I don't like you. like the packs feel high quality, but then you go to open them and it's like oh, it's actually quite oh, tough to open them. They're tough. Uh, I so, used to actually cut the top of a pack with a scissors. Oh, I wouldn't trust myself in case like one um, had popped. If one had popped up like that. And then you actually. Uh, however it. much shameful I am to admit it, I did actually do that once. Exactly, exactly. So, uh, what should we do? Should we go one at a time or? Uh, I think one at a time. One at a time. So, I think I was about to say earlier, we're probably going to do the commons for the first like 10 or so and then just. Yeah, you'll find we'll commons have in the first few. <clears throat> Nail. So, if I remember that, uh, so, uh, so for anyone that listen, if you. Yeah, you've got the abbreviations there, just above the job title. When it focuses. Go on. There you go. So yeah, so that is focuses. the... When Sam presses the button to focus. The <laughs> <laughs> that's obviously the title the games have come out of, and that's interesting to see they've got Dissidia Final Fantasy as well as Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles listed there. Yeah, I didn't realise they put two games in. I mean, surely isn't everyone in Dissidia? Well, not everyone, but like... Uh, it wouldn't surprise me. It's obviously characters. the chibi-style art. Which is what they also used in Crystal Chronicles. Yes, which got re-released pretty recently. Yes, it did, and I have not played it yet. Leal. Fina. Ah, uh, yes. Um, Brave, Brave Exus. Brave uh, One of That's the many the... mobile games. <laughs> Still going, right? Or is that the one they closed? Uh, no, that was Mobius they closed. <clears throat> Scholar from 14. Oh, this has got the, the base 14 jobs in the set. It has. So, interestingly, they had those previously one of the op- opuses as well. Yeah, Opus 3, I think, because I've got a whole bunch. Because it had, like, yeah, uh, I... Archer and Ranger, which I am. Yeah, I uh, Bard, think so. they changed the race that was in them. So I believe the Scholar previously was an Elzen rather than a la- uh, uh, well, a Falafel, as friends of your podcast, Charting, calls them. Calls them Falafels. Yep. <laughs> Paladin from 14, who is now a Huma, whatever they're called. Well, no, that's PSO. What are they called? Humans. <laughs> <clears throat> Luminous Puma. Oh, right, yeah, so they started adding monsters, right? In mm, these. That was in Opus a, 3, I believe they started adding the monsters th- in. Uh, yeah, as like a third type of creature you can use. So this is from 13. 13? Yeah. yeah. Criminally yeah, underrated so, series of games. 13. Yes, it is. People should play it. 13 is so good. Remaster uh, when? For um, Decid- Decidia and. That is Decidia, yeah. I do love that. Alice, is such classic. Alice, one of the best girls in Final Fantasy fourteen. Yes, I love it when she comes back as a red mage and just slaps people about. <laughs> she she's is use- awesome. I mean, she's useless before then. I'm not useless, but like cool in cutscenes and stuff. She doesn't actually do anything, and then all of a sudden she's like, "Oh, I just went away and learned how to become a red mage." And now yeah, I'm super strong. Cool powerful. Deal with it. Ah, oh, here we go. Hells to the air. Foil cloud. That's a special, uh, that's which means that came out of starter deck. Yeah, the cloud from the starter set, apparently. So he can yeah, so clay, you but... don't get those in foil in the starter sets. Obviously, you only get them from the booster boxes, so they're fairly rare. Um, obviously, foils are the ones you generally want. Yeah. <coughs> so the foil, I guess that, that was all common to the pile. Then it goes foil, and then it's hero, rare, rare, rare. So hero, Jake. You can go to a hero pile there. Yotsu. This yeah. Is this is, I just finished, not just finished, but this is where I got to in Final Fantasy XIV, basically. I finished Storm I generally Blade. liked her arc in that as well. The, well. the way they handled her, she was pretty hard done by in life, and it, uh, it <laughs> panned out very well. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's a lot of that whole arc, right, is people trying to rationalise what's going on to them. The war, based on the effectively. The like, yeah, it, coming in and, and trying to ruin their lives. Um, Jinai from FFL. Legends? Yeah, it's Final Fantasy Legends, and that's that's the thing. They really did pick a lot of characters from really obscure titles that a lot of people in the West probably have never played or heard of. Yeah. And Archangel from Eleven. 
who is a goalkeeper, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so those are the card arts I'm not a fan of. They've basically just taken in-game screenshots and slapped yeah. them on the card. For 11 as well, possibly the worst-looking game. Yeah, it's not aged well. The fact it's still no. going is just bonkers. <laughs> right, so let's... Promo cloud, I'll put my foils there. Got my heroes, rares. <laughs> Won't whack the desk again because that wobbled everything and the commons are just over. <laughs> Did you get a beer, by the way? I am currently not drinking in the week. I'm being very Fair good. Enough. Fair enough. I've got a brew by number. Uh, that was not a free beer like our friend. No, no, not free. Not free. Uh, Warrior. More jobs from 14. Yeah, yeah. many, many. Garuda. More. Oh, that's 11 version of Garuda. Yeah, I guess with the summons and stuff, they can just pick whichever game they want for the art. Yeah, especially the... ones that have been multiple times. Although Garuda, yeah. it's not been in many others, have they? Well, Boss in 14 as well. Mm, very good Boss in 14. 14 uh, Samurai. Samurai, the most Four overpowered chips. DPS in the game. Really? Yeah, they're top of DPS except for Black Mage. Black Mage is tricky there. Uh, Dupes already. You get so many commons. It's um... yeah, I know. That's what I said. After about ten, we'll just s slip into Skip the just checking out the rares. Shango. That is such a. I mean, that's the artwork I love. These hand drawn art. Yeah, yeah. From like the original one, two, three style. Like the NES games, this wood guy would have been like three mm. sprites. <laughs> and like... <laughs> you probably wouldn't make out that he has teeth. Yeah, they've just done it off of that monk. Have you ever played monk? I have not. Uh, Dan Weller was a monk main when he first started. Yeah. Slap and he's, around. Because he could give it Super Saiyan hair. That was literally the only reason he done it. <laughs> Whale Zombie from 9. I don't I remember that in 9. I do not know. I played 9 like five times and I do not remember Whale Zombie. Foil is... Archangel oh. EV from 11. Yeah, see, uh, oh. foil rare though, I guess. Foil rare yeah, foils are absolutely lovely though. They always look so good. Yeah. They pop and they've got that That's awesome so shimmer to them. Yeah, um, almost like looks like he's in action. Yeah, I mean that's. I, I know you said about the old other eleven art for the goalkeeper, mm. but like this is the same dude. But like, I think that looks quite cool. Like, yeah, if you played the game a lot and you knew like his boss intro. It would be like that pose, right? And yeah. The it looks it. very cool as it's moving. It almost looks like it's in action. Yeah, the refractor stuff when it's cool. Shalotta. Um, Crystal Chronicles. Uh, Indeed. Uh, Gramps. Favorite. Just Gramps. <laughs> we should look look at what FFL is. I'm pretty sure it's FF Legends, but it's, it's only it, it tells you at the bottom of the card there. If you get that card back, if you look at the bottom, it tells you underneath uh, yeah. the date. Yeah, so it was Final Fantasy Legends. Legends. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, and so is Matoya. To dance a job role though, so, which obviously the job roles do play into the games yeah. set up quite nicely. Isn't Choose Matoya, one monster. Matoya's the wizard? Oh yeah, we're not. We're, the, I should say we're not actually going through any of the the <laughs> like the way the game plays and if these cards are any good. But she enters the field. Well, uh, the thing is, such a pool of cards now that you can almost build a deck for any sort of style of classic card gameplay. Yeah. Jinai. You already Legends. had one of them, haven't you? Not. I think. No, I don't think so. Was it? It was Jake. Was it Jake? Oh yeah, no, two Jinai. Oh, yeah, did you? So duplicate rares in two packs. That's fine. though. you can have up to three of those in a deck. That's true. I'm gonna be. You do tend to get a play set of most stuff. Yeah. Well, aware. when I was obviously yeah. semi-competitive with it. Uh, generally, I'd buy two booster box, a launch. So that's obviously the first six pack boxes. Buy two of those, and whatever duplicates I had, I used to trade to try and complete my play sets. Yeah. I mean, two boxes, you should have almost a play set of everything. Ah, uh, Edgar. Edgar from six. Punchy punch. Man. I love that little chibi art they went for for that. It's just Garnet so cool. from nine. Cutscene Garnet. Yeah, so Nine's got there's a couple of cards for Nine that are just screenshots from the game, but they also done some unique art, which we might see if we get lucky. The whale zombie. Um, oh, is that the one created that you said is by Visual Works? One? Yeah, so you can see there that was a CGI. Yeah, I was going to say like at the time, I remember I remember when this game came out, and I thought the cutscene was by far like this is the best video games are ever going to look. It was absolutely it incredible. still looks incredible to you be fair now. for oh, a PlayStation One title. Fine. Oh. It's all right. <laughs> 
14. Bard. Mama guy. That is the uh, relic weapon as well. Oh, the that first, is, isn't it? The first series relic weapon, anyway. That'd be the animal ones, wasn't it? Yeah. Such nerds. <laughs> Summoner. Oh, my God. That is literally my dude in Final, in Final Fantasy XIV. I have that green <laughs> hair with those ears, with that tattoo on the face as well. <laughs> just and imagine literally... they took your character and just went, ah, oh, he'll do for a card. <laughs> what the hell? I mean, I definitely don't have a half bare chested summoner, but that head is exactly the same. <laughs> you could do quite easily. From Legends. Sid from Legends. Again, Sid is in every game <laughs> they could have picked. That artwork looks like an anime character. He just looks so like I'm gonna yeah. fight people. <laughs> that that is like Neon Genesis as well, isn't it? It's the, uh, the yes, <laughs> which wouldn't surprise me if that was an influence. No, yeah, Chaos Walk of the Fall. Uh, Final Fantasy Twelve Summon Twelve. Yeah, they uh, one thing I'd say about Twelve was the design of the summons was absolutely bonkers. Yes, yeah, Twelve. I mean, Twelve had so much good stuff going up for it. Oh, I, I, another underrated title for me. Common foil. Ooh, you got that. Wow. Ah, but look at the foil on that. It just works so well with his yeah. magic that he's using. Like in how, hand. Yeah, and I do like that it's not emphasised on him at all. They mm. seem to have made the foil like go around. Some of them are emphasised on the characters from yeah. the older opuses. I don't know if they continued it into the later That's ones. Cool. I like that. Good go. Undead Princess, Crystal Chronicles. So Chris yeah, Chronicles yeah. really had a very uh, anime driven art style to it. And Gramps, who we've seen. Gramps Matoya, again. Matoya is the name of the. Oh, Matoya is the. Three. Witch. Three res. Yeah, she's the witch in Final Fantasy 1. Uh, she's also a character in Final Fantasy 14. Yes, you go to Matoya's cave, and when you go in it, it's got the uh, the sweeping mops that. It does um, indeed. It has from Final Fantasy 1 as well, and it plays the music from her cave as well. And. It was in A Realm Reborn, you go there and it's super quick. And then I think in the the next one, they like expanded it a bit and like one In Heaven's Wood, yeah. Yeah, one of the dungeons is about her stuff as well, which is kinda of cool. Right. Also as well, these cards are like nice. Yeah, they went for the higher GSM on them and they they do um they do damage quite easily on the top if you don't sleeve them immediately. Oh, well, this is not going well. I was going to get sleeves within reach in case you got any of the like the 20 big money quid ones. plus cards, yeah, but we'll see. Ooh, Mario. Nothing big bucks yet. From six, Black Mage from 14. And of falafel. course it's a falafel. Falafel Black Mage. Selkie from Crystal Chronicles. She looks a bit Zidane-y. <laughs> it is a bit, it's just that same sort of style. Yeah. Graham. Graham. <laughs> just I love the fact that Legends just, just got the names of people. Yeah. <laughs> so all right, yeah, Graham, right. how's it going? Is Graham? No. That's an interesting art that I went through. Though. It doesn't have a face. For Graham. Just got his arm yes, wrong. it's um. If you can tell, it's kind of purpley, but it's more of a what's it called? Like an artistic impression of Graham, if you know what I mean. It doesn't show you any details. Setzer. Ah, good old Gamber. Strago. Oh, Strago as well. Get all the sixes. Lots of sixes, yeah. Bryn Holder. Ah. So, uh, as you know, at the bottom there where it's A and also one, because they're OG cards that came out in the very first opus. Uh, I thought I recognised it. Cool. Yeah, they... they uh, I don't know whether it's so they got lazy or they didn't have time to produce new cards, but they started reusing some of the summons and monsters from earlier mm. opuses. Yeah, that's not too bad. I mean, I, I, I guess because it's a rare in set one and now they've made it a common. Exactly. So that means more people can have access to it, I guess, technically. But Yeah, I mean, Brynhilda wasn't that powerful early on. Fire no. didn't really come into its own until about Opus 4. Foil Hero. Ooh. Mercenary. Foil Jake. Oh, it's Jake from Brevex, yes. We've got his uh, Which... as well. Brevex is actually got quite a really good story to it. They added uh, all the Final Fantasy VII remake characters to it this week. By the way. Oh, yes, I saw that. And they get their CGI limit breaks in it. So you get this cool little yeah. cutscene. Oh, look at that. Arc. Arc that Just the artwork cool card. is incredible. The artwork. 
Ark was one of the bonkers summons as well in 9. So, cool. who, so, who, so much hard work to get for a summon you would presume would do over four digits of damage, yeah. but still didn't. Okay, so yeah, it tells you that that was uh, done by Matsuda as well. Mm. So yeah, so he done, you can tell I think, stars, three so cards for this. And obviously the... Main the yeah, there's one other as well, which looks even better than Ark does, but Ark uh, being a Transformer is just cool as anything. Pile. Fenrir, again. Fenrir yeah. is cool from 9. Wolf. Cockitus from Legends. Legends again. Death Gaze. Brackets, 9. <laughs> from 9? Once again, I don't remember where... Uh, it's a boss towards the end of the game, I think, when you go to, like, spoilers, you go to, like, Sedan's home planet or something, don't you? Oh, yeah, I remember, you're in a, uh, yeah, I do remember it's that. It's super weird, and you can't leave, and if you didn't, <laughs> you didn't do well up until that point, <laughs> then you're kind of, not screwed, but it's, can be yeah, quite tough. it's hard to grind, because you generally get spanked by everything. Yeah, same as um, in Final Fantasy VIII, when you're, like, again, spoilers, stuck on the spaceship with Squall and Renoa. And if you hadn't, oh, like, was... if you hadn't leveled one of them properly, then you're absolutely boned, and there's no way to like Devastated. get away from it. Yeah, realm from six. Ninja from fourteen. Ah, my main. Oh, uh, is it? I was going to say Chris's main. I think I think it's your main. Yeah. It is my main now. I was OG Paladin, but it's changed since then. Scholar again. <laughs> Graham and Graham. Foil Graham. Sophia. This is cool. White mage. That's in the, uh, yeah, the old okay. school. That's a good angle, that's a good angle. Uh, 14 red mage. Second, Sam. Just got to quickly... Fair enough. Scott has abandoned us. We're going to carry on. A Dragoon from 14 again. Cool designs. I like that it just uses the armour and sets from the uh, from like one of the characters. As I said, when I, when I found the one earlier that looked like my guy, it was pretty cool. Uh, another hero foil. Who have we got? Oh, Squall. Margai. That's so cool. I'm going to put that to the side so we can show Scott when he gets back. Nicole from Brave Exeus. Rare. Uh, <laughs> Librarian. Get it? Librarian. Because it, it's got books and it yells at you. I guess. Lava Spider. Basic enemy from Crystal Chronicles. Another one. And another Archangel Goalkeeper. Try and get focus right on my phone. Scanner. We're gonna plow ahead, we've got so many packs. I can't I can't hang around for the score though. I will take I will have a sip of beer there because I'm getting quite warm. I am sorry somebody was at my door. That's okay. Uh, handing over a bag of broccoli. <laughs> Guess what we ripped. Da, 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 wait, wait, wait. You say ripped, you mean the pack, not the card. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, look at that. Foil Hero Squall. Just as we were talking oh. about how Final Fantasy VIII. That's what it is. Now we need to talk about Final Fantasy IX again and see what else you get. <laughs> is, that, is that the one card that you... There's a card coming that oh, it just looks coming. so good. I've got faith, it's coming. I'm feeling in it. You've got to believe in the heart of the cards. <laughs> that's true, that's what pack opening is all about, having a good time. So, Garuda, Edgar from six again. Where's the Where's the, the good focus point? It's gone. It's it lost likes it. School, it. It likes school too much, that's the thing. If I put that there. <laughs> it's the uh, foil, I think. There we go, yeah, it's stealing focus. There we go. I, I've got questions about why school's standing like that, but... <laughs> uh, it's from the manual. I know that just, that doesn't answer the original art question, but he's he was in like the original manual like that. Yeah, it's just very. Um, it's, it's like so he's going to hand off his gun blade, soon. Maybe it's like it's a way to present it where it's not like okay, I'm definitely not going to stab you, and I can't shoot you as well. Because <laughs> it's like when you hand someone a pair of scissors. <laughs> yeah, and you have to do it like that. <laughs> it's that kind oh, of. Oh, so that artwork. I know a lot of people didn't like them when they first started putting cards like that, the character designs, where mm. they're a bit rough-handed almost. Tactics Advanced, yeah, I, great game. I think I it like looks it. amazing. Yeah, yeah. Does it say who by? Uh, Ryoma Ito. Good game, though. See, and they got some of their... But, I mean, look at those. They oh, just look so good. That's so cool. How could people not like that? That's a really uh -huh. cool stylized look at it. Uh, 
Uh, it's almost like they're in action. It's just yeah. Monk, another fourteen. I think we've had a monk before. Another whale zombie. Cool. I think we've reached the point where we can just go a bit quicker. For uh, quite possibly, yeah. Well, <coughs> coming. Who's it gonna be? Oh, it's oh, double that. whale zombie. <laughs> <clears throat> well, I'm glad that the box warned us that you can have two of the same card in, in a pack. I mean, technically, they're not two of the same card because one's a foil, but. <clears throat> That's uh, a pretty hey, yeah, Coming soon to Final Fantasy VII Remake. Yes. Retrograde or Integrade. Uh, another Archangel from 11. Uh, for the and another Archangel from 11. All of the. F- in eleven Celis. stuff, or oh, Celas. I like that they've t- what they've done with the six characters. It's like the uh, the art on the like remake, not the remake version, but you know the, the jam, um, jam updated version. version they released. Yeah, yeah. Which um, Dan Weller was recently playing on his stream, which I did personally not like. I prefer the OG pixelated one. Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. <clears throat> so what's that? Two hero foils so far. Yeah, Cloud and School. Uh, yeah. Well, Cloud technically is a hero slash. I um, mean, he's about two quid ish. Cool, <laughs> bangers. <laughs> I'm used. I'm used to opening soccer cards now, but uh... <laughs> it's just, yeah, why those soccer cards are so expensive? I do not know. It's just uh, mad. It's insane. It's insane. Umaro from six. Had... It's such an interesting Summoner. character to have in sixteen. <laughs> He'd been fairly normal up to that point. Here's a snowman. In sixteen. In six, uh, six, yeah, yeah, he's just like a yeti type guy. You're like, well, oh you're God. weird. <laughs> Your guy again? I've done it again. I kind of feel you should do a uh, side by side. Get your character in fourteen character. dressed up as a summoner and go. Hang on a minute, copyright. I can, I can bring up my uh, the character sheet for on the, the website. I might do actually. That's a good advance. <laughs> Another one of those cool art. Oh my god! Oh uh, yes, yes. Look at that. That's so cool. As if that's oh. a common. They should have. They could have like heroed that. It's amazing, isn't it? That's so cool. I mean, uh, yeah, yes, black, black mages just the cards. Yeah, that's so cool. I would uh, love the uh, foil variant. Foil of that. variant of that. Basilisk from nine. Baskets. Creepy looking things. <laughs> Alphano to go with his uh, sister. The other twin. And a foil common. Dark Knight. Oh, Dark Knight though. Look at that armour. It's the so edgy boy of Final way. Fantasy XIV. <laughs> <laughs> so emo. Glaive. Which is just a big sword. Fenway again. The one thing you do get when looking at these cards is oh, just wow. the sheer quality of the artists that Square have at their disposal. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. and the, and just like the the like the diversity that are from mm. character designs, from monster designs, from game to game. The mask from Legends. That's another cool one. Yeah, that's a really nice bit of art as well. Right, loads more stuff here. Yeah, when I used to open two boxes in a go, it's a lot of cards and a lot of time. I would normally do way more organising than this as well, but Ramu, yeah, the 11 nice. version. I'm trying to figure out what he's doing there. Is that his hand at the top underneath his name? Uh, yeah. I don't know what the other one's doing. No, I'm really Making confused by his stance. <laughs> Edgar. Yeah, that, oh, just six. Such oh, a great game. Damn it. Focus. There we go. Bad. Selkie again. So then Crystal Crocus. Fairy. Uh, so yeah, that's an Opus 1 card as well. Yeah. Really so useful summoning water decks, that was. Dual numbers at the bottom. Yes, I vaguely remember that. I played it for a little while. Black Mages again. <laughs> Luminous Puma from 13 again. Uh, full common. Uh, <laughs> Electric electric jellyfish. jellyfish. <laughs> Look at that. That's just, he's kind of partially cute and he's like, it also really murdered me quite quickly. Uh, have you played uh, Crystal Crackers? I have. I played it fully on the GameCube, um, which was an experience trying to get four people to play that. Yes, we had, uh, I had to organise it. It took a long time, but we had like four people, four Game Boy Advances as the controllers. Oh, yes. 
plugged into the, the GameCube and we played it like all weekend. What happened to plugging other consoles into consoles to play games? Ugh. I mean, only Nintendo did it and then Nintendo stopped doing it. <laughs> uh, Dreamcast kind of had it with the VMUs. Oh, you could have people was... playing on the little screen on the VMU while you played in game. Yeah. You but could that was uh, just raise your chow in the chow garden. In, in oh, yes. Sonic Sonic Adventure. Adventure. Tyson. Titan. I love that they didn't really change his design for 14. No, it's just a, a big guy who punches things. Uh, non foil Dark Knight. Non foil Dark Knight, so we've got two of those now. Astrologian. Shrago again. What's. Oh, kind of feel that's where my hair's going at the moment. I'm going to have to get my, <laughs> my walk. It's getting so I'm long I can do it. I've shaved one side and just left a whole bunch at the front. <laughs> do what I want with it. Thief. Another foil coming. Oh, uh, sweet. Ooh, that does. The, oh, the way they've done that art, and then with the foil, that just pops. It's See, off again, the I card like, almost. Yeah, I like that the foil gives it depth instead of just glazing it all over the top. They've thought about the, like, the foil application from, from each card. That's so cool. Yeah, it really does look like it's off the card, doesn't it? Almost like a diorama. Oh, do you? Arden. I think he got unfairly treated by people Have you for 15. The DLC chapter. Oh, it's the only chapter I hadn't played. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I bought it. I still haven't played it. Because yeah, I can't remember how to play the game. I, I don't want to just go in. I'd have to like replay some of the game. Yeah. Um, another scene. <laughs> uh, Sid. Sid. He's got a say. dodgy. Uh, I don't know. His he's, spine's a bit messed up in that one. Yeah. I mean, yeah. They're all they're all a bit. Uh. But because his <laughs> name is not just Sid. I mean, can you have Sid more of him in your deck? You, you could have him spine. and another Sid. Yeah. Uh, Matthias Opus Corrupt. 1 yeah. From Once again 12. one of the uh, 12's crazy designs for their summons Yeah the summons were really wild in 12 Black Mage in 14 Golem Crystal Chronicles He's cool He's almost like a Pokemon. Yeah they, where they took the classic monster designs and cartooned them up for Crystal Chronicles was a pretty cool touch Yeah If it oh, Another one of those cool that. tactics That's just so ones. cool <laughs> Hecaton Shear the sounds of 13 were also awesome. Yeah, weird mech hybrids one, though. Yeah. Just... The Shiva motorbike was the best one. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't make any sense. I don't know. Alexander oh. Fort was pretty cool. Yeah. Hero Foil. Ooh. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Xenos. Xenos, the big bad of Stormblood. What's his full name? Xenos von Glavis or something like that. There's a Balsar in there somewhere as well. I don't it? want to quote that wrong because <laughs> any Final Fantasy fan, <clears throat> Dan Weller might come and go, no, it's not his name. Is Zenus von Gallus Balsar or something like that? Oh, I think oh, there's a the Balsar in there. Another Archangel HM. Lion. No, I was right. Is Zenos Yeah, well, is Zenos Ye 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 Galvis, I think is how they pronounce it. Galvis. Von Balsar. Yep, that's it. That's fine. I was right. <laughs> Reno. Ah, uh, Reno. That's a cool art. Now, that's Stylized. the remake art, is it not? Oh, sure no, wait. Bit... Eight was... Opus 8 would have been before the remake. That was the Advent Children art. Advent Children, yeah. So yeah. the Final Fantasy VII cards they've got in this are mainly from Advent Children. Compilation of Final Fantasy, yeah, which means yeah. it's in the extended universe, so it's from the movie. It was that's the cool. Advent Children art. Love a bit of Reno. Yeah. It was... He was done very well in the uh, remake. He was, yes. I liked what they did with uh, him and the bald one. Rude. Rude. No, I'm not rude calling you rude. Just rude. Not, not, <laughs> not, not great naming, but Umara. <laughs> and Ifrit. Ifrit again. Scholar again. Scholar again. Bloody falafels are everywhere. Time Mage. He's cool. Black Mage again. That, uh, that, if you drop that foil, that's just going to be awesome. I really want that. That's... I know it's only a common, but I think that's the most wanted one I've got. This is a foil rare from Mobius Final Fantasy. Right. Oh, look at that. Ooh. So that's effectively, they've gone, right, let's put Ramu and Odin together. Yeah. Ramu, that Odin, amazing, Raiden. Man. Yeah, he's cool. It's a really nice foil. Oh, yeah, Veritas of the Dark. Look at that. Did you play much Brave X? Yes, you seem to oh, I played that. quite a lot of it. <laughs> It's one of those mobile games you can easily sync time into. Uh, okay. Prompto. Prompto. 15, yeah, underrated. 
Yes, I like. I, I love fifteen. I love playing through it. I mean, it's safe to say we like all the Final Fantasies. So. I mean, they're all good. Yes, but <laughs> <laughs> she said, "I'm a self-proclaimed fan. You're just as bad." Shiva, need to reposition my hands. Eleven Shiva. Odin, that's a Opus One card again. That's yeah. in Opus One when it first launched. That was so ridiculously powerful. Choose one forward and break so it. Yeah, so basically just yeah. kill. Yeah, there wasn't a lot of answers to that at the time. Astrologian again. Astrologian again. Knight. I love the Onion Knight design. It's such a classic. Mm. More whales. We've got so many whale zombies. <laughs> zombies might be more again. Uh, what are we looking for here? Oh, Final Fantasy Nine. I know rare foil. Oh, Death Gaze. Gaze. Yeah, he's cool. That's such a creepy thing. Very Andrewldy. Very oldy. <laughs> Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. Nine. Melty Gemini. <laughs> Melty Gemini. More Archangel from 11. And the Death Machine. That looks like Amiga weapon. Like OG Amiga weapon. They've just called him Death Machine and made him a bit smaller. Yeah. Yeah, the mini death machine, the small death yeah, machine. Yeah, Crystal Chronicles took all those classic designs and she beat them up, which some people didn't like and some people did. Depends yeah, similar it. to what, um, yeah, the other PlayStation, the World of Final Fantasy did as well. Yes, yeah, she beat it up big time. Oh, what are you? From Fortnite. Axe World and Maniac. Ninja. Ah, oh, so that's, that's a advanced. nice card. That's a cool that. I like that it's got that kind of the blood splatter because it's a ninja, but obviously they didn't want to cover it in blood, so it's white. <laughs> 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 Paint it in yourself. Ultra from Chronicles. Moogle Knight. It's just so cool. I love the fact it's rough around the edges on that. It's just yeah. ah, the machinist. That machinist. Dragoon. That, so that card there, if you go back to that second the Dragoon, the way they've done the clouds around in there is though he's coming down from a jump. Oh, yeah. Is it like cool. he's in motion? Yeah, that's clever. It's just such a clever way of doing it. To make them, make them look like it. Sabine. Uh, foil common. Shiva uh, from Shiva. 11. That, that, I mean, the picture's terrible. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's the only problem with those 11s. It's not aged well. Sakura from Brave yeah, X, yes. That's, that's a, a unique Amano. card, isn't it? Yeah, that's a mono. Yeah, so that's one of the hand-drawn Cover images. Up. So yeah. he done a load of hand-drawn illustrations for this. See, that Shiva would have looked amazing in foil. Oh, yeah, that's way better than like that. I mean, if you look at the difference between the art. <laughs> like this, they've just it's a glow up, as the young hip people say. <laughs> yeah. Like, right. I'll start caning through those commons now. Powering through. Um, do you think we've sent all the commons? Quite Slash possibly. I'll do one more pack. And then I'll, we'll just skip them. Marlene. Marlene! Oh, that is so oh, cute. that's so cool. Oh, we would have skipped that. <laughs> <laughs> that is so adorable. Cute. Yeah, that's cool. That's one of the best ones. Garuda again. Samurai again. The old samurai again. Archer again. Leviathan. Don't think I've had him yet. From 11. No. Once again, the artwork's just not aged well. Punk. Uh, punch, a punch, foil punch rare. Face. Ooh. What? Scale toad. Scale toad. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Uh, Amaranth. Again, that's, a that's an Amano. original illustration, isn't it? Yeah, this is yeah, Amano art. Because he looks way more human than he does in Nine. <laughs> yes, I wasn't really sure what he was when I was when you get to that point of the game. Yeah, it's a very odd-looking bloke. Rude to and Reno. That's interesting. Oh. So I think if and you put Scarf. Reno and Rude next to each other, it's like they're actually staring at each other. Yeah, it'll they'll be like. Which makes me same. wonder if they've just taken some concept art from Advent Children at some point and gone, here you go. It's like they're in conversation about how they're going to do Cloud Over. <laughs> <laughs> That's really cool, actually. Go get Ares. <clears throat> oh, I've stopped putting heroes in the same pile as someone. It doesn't matter. The organisation's all over the place. I'm going to have to... <laughs> I was going to say, this is like my OCD for when I was opening packs has gone out the window. <laughs> Oh, yeah. There's, there's, I there's, used to split them by element first. Yes, yeah, so I don't, because that's how the numbers are done, right? So. Mm -hmm. Just, Just sleeving away in tiny. That foil is 
kommen. Hey. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> we wouldn't have missed it. No, we just got the even better foil version of her. Ah, oh, she's so cute. So, <laughs> is that an original? Yeah, it is it an original character illustration? Isn't it? Yeah. Namura himself it says designed by Namura. Yeah, that's cool. That is uh, so so cool for heroes. We've, got Noctis. we've almost got the whole fifteen gang. Marsh. Oh, that's a very good. That's card. a cool one. Yeah. Time Wizard. Lion from Eleven and Mobius, apparently. And another one of those Archangel ones. Yeah, Mobius had a lot of uh, cameos. Basically, the Square mobile games do. That's why I'm partially excited for First Soldier. Yeah. Fina. Uh, Graham. Fedef, so you Brynhilda. Thief. Covering up. Hero Foil. Freya. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. Original Again, another original yeah. Amano art. That's so Nine, just really. Uh, other than the, stunning. I mean, Garnet and Ico were taken from the uh, cutscenes, but Freya and Amaran. Yeah, I think. Uh, been done really well. Is it worth as much as you think it would be for something so awesome? I think a lot of the cards ended up being collector cards, to be honest. You saying you want in your collection because they look so good. I mean, that design is just bonkers. What, the libra li librarian? Yep. Because <laughs> it's a bookcase that yells at you. Lava Spider we've had. And that is the cool Shiva. Not the bad mm. Shiva, we got the foil off. Um. Yeah, I've actually got all of the Final Fantasy cards for 14 up to Opus 6 separated, which I'm going to get framed up one day because it's all the job cards. Yeah. Which I think will look really good. Uh, 14. Have we seen that yet? Have we? I don't think so. Again, that's the uh, the anima. Relic yeah, weapon. it was all the relic weapons. That's the two I've done with the White Mage and the Bard, so I recognise them. <laughs> oh, foil legendary from now. Oh, hello. What have we got here? It is... Garland. Oh, look at that. And once again, original illustration. Yeah, they really He's did, just uh, the drawings well are so, so good. Got the Blood Moon. There. Oh, yeah. That looks amazing. I love yeah, the fact he's cool. more humanised the characters from Nine with that. Oh, yeah. Uh, Xenos. As you now know, he's called him. multi here we've had. Apodudu. A near mint version of that Garland would get you four quid. Not bad. It's but the cost if you've got it rated, it obviously would be worth more. Well, yeah. There's, I, mean, I don't think there's any cards in this set that are going to be worth rating. As in, well, I think it's your own personal choice a lot of the time, isn't it, I think? Yeah. Uh, we got Rami, Edgar, Graham, Scott, Lewis, Chachiko, Brynhilda, Luminous Puma. Hiding the rare foil. Death Machine. So you are right. Death machine. You are it right. does look it's like a mega like <laughs> weapon. Yeah. Another cool finish on that. Undead Princess and Chris Chronicles. How do you? Such a bonkers yep, design. Yeah, Suya. And that's <laughs> the yeah. There we go. Celeste. We've had quite a few Celeste. of the where you get the foils in the pack. The same mm. card is, is in that pack. The only that's time I got lucky times. with that was Opus 1. Legendary Cloud followed by Foil Legendary Cloud, which at the time nice. I sold for 80 quid. Oof, nice. Early game, it was very, very sought after. Yeah, I guess as the card pool gets deeper as well, like cards mm. can only ever be a certain. Uh, so we got oh, Hero Foil. I'm a hero. From Legends, though. Glaive. That works quite nicely with a foil, though, to be cool fair. piece of art. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. I like that he down. takes up so much space. So a foil is a bit more of a mm. an effect than just a thing. So that's cool. Steiner. Oh, look at that. Once again, it's that original illustration. It's just so good. Yeah. I mean, that they, they, you don't get that impression of Steiner at all in the game. It's so cool to see, like, from the original character design as well, like the tape, this this tape mm. on the uh, on the characters. And how he looks like a hardened it. guy who's not. A bit... And then you get Eco, which is just the CG yeah. stuff. <laughs> he carried Garnet, but got a bit shortchanged in this. Let's see, I don't know if they're um, foil illustrated art in these ones or not. I mean, you would have thought they would have just done one for each character. No, they did not. 
Yeah, so the two girls got a bit. <laughs> well, no, they have Freya as well. She did. She did well, but Garnet and I came Freya less, but... Yeah, the Freya. I'm glad we got the foil Freya. Uh, the Big boy Titan again. Do 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 do. Seen all those. Dragoon. Dragoon. <laughs> Hiding the common. Is it going to be something we want? It's Garnet. Nope. <laughs> I mean, it looks uh, better with the foil, but it's still It does. Weird. Yes, uh, there it is. Look at that. So, so Maydeen cool. in 9 looks nothing like that. No. It just looks amazing. If that in foil cool. would look absolutely stunning. That should have matsued. Uh, that and that's what awesome I was saying before foil. we started recording, how it looked a bit like a bunga, where they've done the design. Oh, yeah. Uh, looks like it just looks insane. Hmm. Oh yeah, it does actually. He's going to punch you into the moon. Yeah. And then you have to buy the DLC to get the ending of the game. <laughs> and fight Ryu at some point. Oh, that game is insane. That game is insane. In, on, in so many different ways, that game is insane. <laughs> People should play it if they ever get a chance. Yeah. Such a obscure title. I'm just chucking bits on the floor now. I've run out of space for empty packages. Archer. Do love those. Foil. Legendary foil. Oh, go on. From Mobius. Something amazing. That'd uh, be one of those dudes. Actually, Duncan. that looks dope. <laughs> Alex, that is a cool design. I cannot believe his name is Duncan. <laughs> this is the, they really did just go for uh, a Western yeah. name on Mobius because I think yeah. it was a big. They even put it on Steam. It was oh, just really? like a free to play game, yeah. That does look cool, though. That is cool. Like, good old Duncan. V oh, v v. oh v my v god. My look, boy. At that. look at Oh man, that's a keeper, that one. Right? No, look at that. That is so cool. Oh, that and foil would be so cool. The man's Phoenix. got some talent. Yeah. So now we do have all of the uh, the road crew. Marsh and Scout again. Going on a boy's trip. Yes. I love the first half of that game. Where it's like it's just... so good. Cruising around weekend, car, it? <laughs> doing hunts if you want to, doing side missions. You don't really know what the story's about yet. It's really cool. Uh, Titan Warrior, Dark Knight Sophia. I think that might be new. Yeah, we saw that one. It's the one in the cool white mage Mogul costume. Oh, and your knight is hiding a rare common from fourteen. Probably a job. Oh, it's Alphano. It's Alphano. Nice. One of the key Sions. <laughs> Oh, how about? Oh, look at that. Is that. So that is your box art. Um, yep. Just look at it. So, so, so good. good. So well done. These hand-painted uh, mm -hmm. Matsuda arts are so cool. Grams. There's good. three or four artists there that are just good. at the top of their game. Oh, yeah. All right. Uh, I oh, love Reddit. the fact it encourages a lot of art within the community. So if you go on Reddit, the artwork you see on there is of exceptional level. Nice. Have we hit any of the big cards yet? Mm, biggest got, is about what? five quid. Yeah, not bad. There Depending are 20, 26 cards on Big Orbit cards were over a tenner, I noticed. Oh, yeah, they're all foils. foils yeah. And bear in mind that Big Orbit cards only ever list them as near mint. They won't yeah, ever yeah, pay yeah. you for a mint condition card. Brynhilda, a foil. <laughs> oh, poor old Zaz. <laughs> Can't see the chick in his hair, though. Ark. <sighs> see, if only it was the other way around, and got that one I know. If I really want... We've got to get one of those. Uh, one of those Amano. OG arts in foil would be that's amazing. Amano, so that's Matsuda. Amano's the, Matsuda uh, or Amano, Amano yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a cool little picture. That, that would be good in foil. That one. Uh, no, the, uh, the Raiden. That is oh, a cool little design, though. <laughs> that is a cool design. Uh, right. Trucking along. Maybe 10 or so left to go. But now we're flying, so we'll, we'll get through these pretty quickly now. Red Mage. Odo, Red Mage, Fairy, Basilisk, Dragoon. Uh, common in this set. Uh, this is a rare in Opus 2. Interesting. Yeah. Jewel set. Matthias. Oh, Matthias the Corrupt, which is also a boss in 14. Is it? Hmm. Have I fought them yet? Uh, you wouldn't have, because it is the Stormblood Raids. Okay. Hero Jake. 
Shiva. And the cool Shiva. Sid. And Sid with his dodgy back. Word is, yeah. I wonder if uh, Sid will be in the next part of Final Fantasy VII Remake. I think we might get Vincent and Sid in part two. Because I would have originally said Yuffie and Vincent and I mean, Sid, definitely Vincent if you're going to... Um, they've got town. to, surely, if it goes to Nebelheim. Yeah. But I, I, it's going to be interesting to see how they bring him into it. Same way they've done Yuffie, they've really mixed it up. Yeah. There's a few cards we haven't actually seen yet that look really good. Oh, really? Commons? Uh, a couple of heroes. Oh, okay, cool. Oh, very. I had a foil of that, actually. I had a playset yeah, for it. Well. That's the dance weird. Look at the way his face He looks right. so strange. <laughs> yeah. Because uh, that I'm was guessing, the Dissidia, yeah. I was guessing because it's DFF, it might be his Dissidia character model. Yeah, it was from NT, wasn't was it? That design. Uh, arcade game, right? The original Dissidia. Yeah. So, uh, well, that longer. the original Dissidia was a PSP title. Oh, I'm thinking of Ur Guys. Sorry, but yes. Ur Guys, oh god, that game is weird. <laughs> oh, I hate see. I hate when that happens. What do I do now? I'm halfway down. Yeah, just kind of get your fingers there and gently put it. Otherwise, you're not damaging anything. But there is, there is, uh, there's scope for error, which I don't like. At least like, uh, we the... had a Veritas of the Dark. Did you not? Yeah. It's about seven quid. No, no, that's all right. Sid from Legends. Weirdly, the non-foil version is more than the foil version. <laughs> That's weird. Uh, foil rare. Ooh. Uroha. Oh, that's that. Uroha, I think it was called. Maybe yes. Uroha. She's cool. Cool design. That is a cool design. She's fighting someone. Because that's another True. hand there, isn't it? Yeah, there's uh, something in the background there. She find someone. The foil oh, works. It's in, really in the foreground, yeah. That somebody's hand mm. and uh, so I can actually see someone. it better. I can see it better on the camera than I can in real life, which is weird. It's the way that the foil is working. Uh, Palom, Palom, which means Porum, Porum should be somewhere. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Prompto Rain, Bravex, yes. He was the lead, one of the leads in it. Quotus is a strange name. Right, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten to go. And left. We want. We want a Matsuda Look. foil. Oh, yeah, it's good. We Just want even if they're not worth money, you want it. <laughs> another Amano foil. And. I don't know. Bahamut. Uh, do, 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 do. And that Black Mage and foil. That Black that Mage and foil would be amazing. That would be quite nice. It's probably one of my favourite cards from any of the Rare, yet. From nine. It's going to be one of the CGs again. Yep. It is. I <laughs> just, God, the that face man. looks so bad. And the regular that, frame. See? Oh, just that in foil. If they were the wrong way. Well, I've got, <sighs> we've got that. That's down there somewhere. Uh, Ignis. Good old Ignis. The Mask. How to him. Uh, it's not Jim Carrey. I'm disappointed. <laughs> I know. That'd be cool. Uh, a cool... Um, Cameo. Let's see, oh, that, that opened. Ooh. Perfect. Ninja, Leo, Dark Knight, Ashley, Jim, Earth, for now, Thief. Another common foil from Legends. Sid. Slash. Grumpy Sid. Man from. Sinji's dad. Neon Genesis. <laughs> yeah, I, like, I can't remember his name. The guy from Neon Genesis Evangelion. He is a meme. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, Dark Fina. Oh, She's quite high up well. on the list, right? I, I, she, I recognized... the normal Fina is. I don't know about the dark Fina. I've opened two Finas. I thought it was the dark uh, one. Dark Fina foil is high up on the list. Oh, okay. Normal Fina is high up on the list. Dark Fina normal isn't the hit for some reason. I've not. Yeah, narrow down the search. That was cool art. Though. I just those original. I'd love to be able to draw like that. Yeah. I mean, uh, once again, nice the video. normal Dark Fina is worth more than the foil version. Only by a 30p, but that's four quid. I swear I opened a couple of uh, Finas. No, we had, had we? So it was a seven okay. cost card as well. They're, they're pretty them expensive them cards to play. I've been putting them in the wrong piles. <laughs> <laughs> 
my OCD is going crazy. Well, I've got big old... These are the rares, but I accidentally put a lot of uh, legends in there as well. And these are the heroes, which now has some legends in it. And that's Cloud, and these are the foils. <laughs> Luckily, it's out of focus, because the focus is up here. But it's not going to annoy you too much. Shiva, Warrior, Ninja, Waltrill, Sid, Chaos. LSA hiding a hero foil from Ooh. nine. It's going to be one of those CG things. It is, right? because it doesn't have... Oh, no, it's got Matsuda. No, wait. Is that it's Bahamut? It's got Matsuda. It's got Matsuda. That's Bahamut? Or... Oh. oh, it's Meiji. Look at that. Oh, That just looks insanely good. The card you called out as your favourite. Mm. We got in hero foil. Oh, so that does look so, so good. I mean, it's probably not worth a lot, but... With Final Fantasy cards, Qu that's not what, that's about not what we're quid. here for. That's, yeah, that's not what we're here for, for Final Fantasy cards. I want the art. It's nothing to do with selling these okay. cards. I only used to sell my duplicates. Yeah, yeah. Oh, exactly. I've not, I've got, we've not uh, seen that Alexander yet, have we? Uh, it's the one from Seven. Seven slash Mobius. Yeah. It looks a bit better than the one in Seven. Oh, that's interesting, actually. Will Remake eventually have all of the summons? Will we get an Alexander? I mean, you would have thought so. The how's that going to work? Are so cool. Mm, but how's yeah, that going to work? Because he's not exactly a mobile character, unless he just stands at the edge of the arena shooting laser beams across. Turns into an FPS. <laughs> Bullet hell shooter for the boss. <laughs> oh, so much good stuff to come from remake. Foil rare from eleven. Be one of those <laughs> dreadful <laughs> CG. <laughs> So that looks bad, so, it? so bad. I mean, it's some really... cards you just don't want. Yeah. That's probably yeah, worth they... 20p. Good old dunk. Good old... That looks really good without the foil as well, actually. Yeah. Hero Hurricane. The better Alexander, as in 9. Oh, is... look at that. Love Alexander in 9. Such a cool surprise. It was. You just. Because you figured he wasn't going to be there. Yeah. And, and then, well, he no, is. it's actually the entire city. And he saves a lot of people. Yeah. And sacrifices himself. I mean, we kind of, uh, in hindsight, you think, oh, the city's called Alexandria. <laughs> it looks like a giant castle. Yeah, now it seems really obvious, but it's quite young. <laughs> nine to start yeah. with. In nine, it was such an awesome surprise. Uh, Shiva, Selkie, Bard. My 15th was on Wales. Mechanist hiding the rare foil from Exvius. Rain. There's a rain is that is that? worth a lot of money, um, uh, but I think it's a light version rather than the fire similar. element. Uh, different, different game. Yeah. Similar style. So it's not the fire rain. Oh, double check. See Queen Queena. Oh, look at oh, that. Oh, wow. More of my art. That's kind of creepy. <laughs> I mean, Queena is very creepy. Strange design, but that is incredible. Lovely piece of artwork there. Uh, again, again. Wow. That's about the seventh time that the foil Damn. has been in the same pack as the regular card. Uh, Shamond. P. Grouchy. And that dope Radian from... <laughs> that foil, Rain, is like 24p. <laughs> nice. Wow. At the moment, it's obviously, it's... Big orbit prices. Well. Disclaimer, are not full representation of what you can get for those cards. No, this is just the, it's just the easiest, quick way to check card prices. Especially if you're selling your duplicates. Yes. Flog them off, get credit, and buy the card you need. Yep. Oh, I, did, oh, I didn't realise. That is the foil. That <laughs> is, yeah. So minimal foil. He's such a yeah. big boy, that's why. <laughs> so he that did not it. It's skip. literally that corner. It's I massive. It. it makes him look actually more uh, kind of imposing on that with the little foil, because you realise he's how much of the card he's taken up. Yeah, too much. Uh, we've got a legend behind here as well. Oh, Natch. Now that... From Legends. I'm sure it was worth some reasonable money. Oh, nice. That wasn't a foil, was it? It's just grey background. Nacked, yeah, not foil. Regular. Proquetus again. I, I, look, again. Wow. Foil and regular. Has he got birds flying around his head on that? Uh, yeah, yeah. You can't oh, see them in the full version, but they're there. Yeah. No, 
They're just giving him some real oh, scale, can, haven't they? You kind of can see it on the full. Oh, you can see him, yeah. It gives him full scale. That, that's, that looks really cool, actually. Yeah, the uh, that takes up way too much. Yep. Is four quid. Ooh. And that's the non foil version. Yeah. Making a good £15 bag. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, again, this box is like half price, and I'm definitely not going to sell any of them. So. No, yeah, you won't sell the cards anyway. You want to keep them. I mean, the prices do fluctuate based on every time a new opus comes out because you might get a combo of cards that increases the value of something. Yeah, exactly. Which happens a fair amount. Just need to mute WhatsApp because annoying noises when Matt gets hold of things. Ninja. Ninja. Summoner. Oh, I think I've spoiled it. Common foil. Setsa. Setsa. That's cool. Baby Sephiroth. <laughs> <laughs> I've never looked at him that way. Oh, Laswell. Laswell from Bravey. Iroha. Another Reno. The Mask. The Mask. Right. Mokin. Down to three. Can we get one more hero or legendary foil? What are you saying? It's the under over. <clears throat> that would be common foils, probably. <laughs> no. Give us a Vivi. Yeah, all that. Uh, the Black Green Mage. Cool. Uh, it's a hero foil. From? Crystal Chronicles. Echoes of Time. Yes, Charlotte. With a uh, Cassif, not Catsif. Yeah, little, little Catsif. Huh? That's cool. Oh, we did get one more hero foil. Warrior of Light. From one. That. Another hero. Another Alexander. That in foil would look Alexander. good. Yeah, that would be really cool. Whereas I keep losing where my hand is meant to go for <laughs> focus. Uh, uh, Dodgy next hit. Oh, I did that one really bad. I'm surprised I didn't bend a whole bunch of those. I will say, yeah. from doing like, all the expensive soccer card stuff, those packs basically just fall open like you don't have to try it at all which is really good <laughs> considering how much they cost inside uh, oh, just it's insane why those soccer cards as the American school and cost so much just, I know. Uh, I've got a couple of packs here I'm going to be doing that, that break that, that'll be next week they were about £400 for seven cards <laughs> what <laughs> yeah I know Jeez. but they've, they've got like actual uh, autograph on card they've got like they're like thick cards and they have like a uh, match worn jerseys and stuff on them and that kind of stuff. So, wow. Yeah, some of them might be worth a lot, some of them might not, and I'll probably lose money, but it's all for fun. <laughs> and it's all for their content. Another starter. Ooh. Uh, start from Go Setsu! Oh, Go Setsu! He's so cool. He is so cool. Ha ha ha. That's uh, my impression of Go Setsu. Yeah, it was pretty much spot on. He yeah, I thought it was pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow. Alba from Legends. That's cool. That's I mean, really that's cool artwork. Basically Sailor Moon, but oh well. Yeah, I was going to say, they, they, it was clearly influenced by a lot of anime from the Final Fantasy Legends. Or uh, the girlfriend in Death Note. Yep. Cannot remember or the, name. the lolly in any anime series. Yeah, it's essentially everything. Yeah, but, uh, now that's rude. And more Archangel. Right, last one. Come on. Come Come on. on. One of the decent Amano arts in foil. Either an expensive card, or yeah, we want we want a mano. We want a mano. Might as well do it all like this. Hey, look, Fina, Fina, common. That's where I was seeing it. Yeah. So there's another style of Fina as well. Yeah. Oh, good old Graham. Red mage. Oh, that's cool, red mage. To be fair, it is common. And it's Crystal Chronicles, and it is Wild that one? Drill. Drill. He's cool. Boom. That's cool. I just like it the general cool black magey style design of the the hat, hat, the and face, the yeah. shadow face. Yeah. Uh, Gladius, his hero. You can go there. Lion, librarian. The man eating library, and then one of the awful art. eleven artworks just taken straight out. Yeah. So, I mean, got all these foils. That's 36. Some pretty good cards. I accidentally put Alexander in there. 
some of them do look so so nice. That May Dean uh, just looks amazing. Yeah. Uh, the Duncan, the Glaive, he's quite cool. The Freya, obviously, the Marlene. Oh yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, that Marlene Raiden. actually. Xenos is quite cool. The Archer, obviously, even though it's a common. The Cloud, the Squirrel. Yeah, so wow, these, the Marlene foil, 25p. <laughs> Sweet. I mean, she's probably useless, but so these were the big hits, I guess. I mean, yeah, as in big then, hits on just... These are the ones that look coolest. Yeah, you know, so I don't. Th- I never ever used to sit there and go over money on these cards because oh, no, I just not love the designs. No, uh, yeah, so we, we should have That is the remake for, artwork, isn't it? It's just a way for us to organise it because uh, I'm not selling these. They're just going in a bold, in a folder. So. Being uh, kept I think it can't be, right? Yeah, oh, you know, it says it's a remake at the bottom. Yeah, yeah. I guess when I was in Japan, like they had so much stuff for remake, and it was be- that was before the game came out. So I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, if I was going to say, well, what it was announced in 2015. Yeah, I'm sure they were throwing art everywhere. Archer was uh, cool. Let me check. Raiden was cool. No, Marley. Marley. Marley so was so cool. That's so cool. That's the best card. I don't even care what it does. Freya was obviously <laughs> amazing. I'm so glad we got an Amano foil there. Glaive is cool. Dunk Big man dunk. Oh, a little bit of dunk. And the Maydeen. And that Suda foil as well. Sweet. Good stuff, man. That was fun. Love it's it. always fun. Good I cars. used to just absolutely... It was more fun opening the cards, sleeving them, bundling them away, finding out what play sets I got from boxes than actually playing half the time. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. That was like that was. Uh, as I say, I don't really play the game, so I don't really know. I can't remember what release dates there were for these. Opus say it came out about two years ago, maybe. But that's the thing; they completely upped the release schedules, and it was impossible to keep on top of. Um, yeah. It got super expensive super quickly. They, the promo cards they release are quite interesting and they're very hard to come by. Uh, there was signed ones um, at uh, Gamescom that I went to back in 2017. Oh yeah, you're going to get your... Uh... Summoner. Oh, it's not the it's not the right browser. I've changed browsers. Hold on. <laughs> there we go. Green hair, pointy ears, that same smirk, uh, and the tattoo. That was my character. <laughs> they are so so similar. Oh, my word! I- I'd complain to Square Man. Uh... I know they're using my character. <laughs> I mean, I'm not a summoner. Maybe I should be a summoner so I can use this card. Change for summoner. You do get to call Bahamian oh, yeah. and burn people on the ground. Obviously, my guy is in a tuxedo because the only thing I used to do before I logged out was crafting stuff. So that's why he's in a crafting suit. Because <laughs> <laughs> Sam had an addiction. Uh, yeah, man, I love some crafting. Uh, okay, cool. so Opus 8 came out in 22nd of March, 2019. Wow, so more than a full year before Remake. Mm. And yet they were but already then, using the art on some cards. Like we said, the remake initial, because that's probably some of the artwork they released back in 2015 when they'd done that initial trailer launch. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Oh, that well, Freya looks amazing. I know. That Maydeen, though, just looks so badass. I know, that's definitely the best one. Cool, I think we can call it there. We've been one hour and nine minutes, man. That's, that's well, a long time to be talking nerding about. Nerding over Final, Final Fantasy, Fantasy artwork. Um... <laughs> Have another box. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I know. I know that you know. You know the story, but I accidentally ordered two. Um, well, I thought one was never coming, and then I went to cancel it, and they sent it at the same time that I ordered the replacement. So I, ac- I accidentally got two. But we maybe stream that again because that was quite fun. But we'll do. We'll skip straight through to the doing the full stuff. We got through the last well, like, fifteen to twenty packs much much quicker than the first. Five, goes a lot quicker. Really. So yeah. That was, that was what you want pretty, is to get a list so. of the cards you haven't got. Because there's a few that look amazing. Yeah. Yeah. We've got some good pulls. 
pretty happy with that. Um, cool. Yeah, thanks for joining me, Scott. Thanks for no, giving us thank your you fine for fantasy me. knowledge. No, no worries. We'll get you on again. I mean, maybe on the next stream, as we can go through it a bit quicker, I can explain some of the bits on the cards, and they do try to make their abilities within the game thematic to their characters. Yeah, that's a good That's a good point. This time was way more about the art and just cranking through it, but if we only do foils, legends, heroes, and even the rares towards the end we were slamming through, um, yeah, you can help us understand what some of the... Uh, abilities do and how the game plays because we definitely didn't touch on that at all <laughs> at all who cares you look at the artwork and interestingly on the official square site they've got four artists listed as doing exclusive illustrations oh, cool. uh so you've got masuda um yeah, izumi good. sawa a guru and ito so uh, that's interesting because that means uh, that... this glaive is a guru mm. Amano, Amano. What was the Maidine? Uh, the Maidine's Matsuda's. Okay, so... Yeah, this, that, the Maidine um, and the Duncan, that's the Matsuda style. Yeah, so the... Uh, the Amano, Amano the Final is Fantasy not is the exclusive Amano. illustration. It's literally just his artwork he must have done as concept. Yeah, for the... Uh... I won't go get the book. We've got a book. This 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 stream will just go on forever if I go get. Have you actually got the ultimate yet? No wait. Yeah, 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 I do. I'm gonna go grab it. Nah, another day. Another day. <laughs> it's come back. I was, I was. We could do the outro. We'll do that next time. I'll, I'll have the book ready for next time. <laughs> yeah, so we can cool. share at the start because that is yeah. awesome, awesome artwork. I've, 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 yes, thanks for having me, Sam. It's been no a pleasure. Uh, cool. Uh, everyone at home, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, then give us a comment. We we enjoy doing it, so it's all the good stuff. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. If you've got this far, thank you very much. This has been a long video, and uh, we will see you next time. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Bye.